Hey guys, this is James and welcome to a new episode of Each and Every Effect in Adobe Premiere Pro. Today we are going to see how you can use simple parametric equalizer in Adobe Premiere Pro. Very basic effect. I would not use that effect a lot because I love to use a visual equalizer like parametric equalizer. So uh, let's see how you can use that, right? So if I just go to here on my effects panel, again, you can just go to window, then enable effects. And from the effects panel, you'll see audio effects and there you'll see filter and eq folder there is the effect simple parametric equalizer just click and drag this equalizer here on your audio there you'll see some parameters so that is the center frequency where you want to change this right then the q the width of that uh, spectrum and then the boost right so that is apparently the opposite of a notch filter in notch filter what did we do so when you are using a notch it will decrease the volume or frequency response of a certain frequency right but here, when you are using a simple parametric equalizer, it will increase the volume of that particular frequency. Suppose I want to add some bass on my voice, right? So I can just go here and from there I can just add 200, the frequency, and then I can increase the boost difference and how. And from here I can change the width, maybe 11, and there I can again include some boost and ensure your video looks great so it will increase that particular frequency so what is apparently it is doing if i show you using parametric equalizer so if i just add it here then i can go to edit so it is just apparently increasing this section right so if i increase it like that so that is what it is doing so here is our frequency that is the cutoff and then the gain that is the boost and the q or width that is the section that is affected if i increase it it will affect less of our frequency if i decrease it it will affect more of our frequency so if i play it back handles them can save your hours of frustration and ensure your video looks great everywhere if you so apparently it is doing the same thing if i add it 200 hertz Premiere Pro handles them. You can see the sound is pretty output. similar. So that is what our simple parametric equalizer is doing. You can do that using a simple parametric equalizer. That is a analog effect of parametric equalizer, right? Add it, then set your frequency, then increase your boost. Hours of frustration and ensure your video looks great. So everywhere that will boost that frequency section so that is how you can use simple parametric equalizer in adobe premiere pro i hope you have liked this video if you have liked this video and learned something new from this one then you can give me a thumbs up if you know this channel want to learn adobe premiere pro or video editing then you can subscribe to this channel to get more awesome video just like this one i'll catch you guys on the next one until then goodbye